Today I want to show you how you can achieve great masters using the new released Ozone 10. This plugin can be really intimidating, but with a couple of basic moves you can achieve great results. Let's jump into a mastering session and let's see what Ozone 10 is all about. The song that I'm gonna use today is called Moving On. You can find it on Spotify and YouTube and it sounds like this. Ich hab dir gegeben, was du wolltest, doch du warst immer toxic, hier zu bleiben war impossible. Ich war immer für dich da, wann ich es konnte. Trotz all dem Kopf, ich, baby, ich war immer down with you. Ich war down with you bei jedem Streitgeld, den wir so hatten. Ich hab keinen Plan, ob du's weißt, für alles tun, für dein Lachen. Doch es ist aus mit uns beiden, girl, es ist jetzt vorbei. First, I wanna show you how you can have a great sounding master without diving too deep into the technical stuff. Here's where the master assistant come into play. To use the master assistant, you just have to switch to the assistant view and hit play. It's uh, recommended that you play the song in uh, the loudest uh, part. Ozone will listen to your track and will create a suggested processing chain. This is what we have here. The cool thing about this is that the chain is based on the analysis of top 10 songs for each genres. So Ozone is trying to match your song to a professional master the song. This is how the interface uh, looks after the assistant is done. I really like how it looks and the simplicity of it. Here you have everything you need to make adjustments to the song. One thing that I like doing is go through a couple of targets and listen to what sounds uh, best. You can find the targets in the left side. Let's uh, go through a couple of them. This is the hip hop. Ich war down with you bei jedem Streit, girl, den wir so hatten. Kein Plan, ob du's weißt, für da, für dein Lachen. Doch es ist aus mit uns bei, girl, es ist jetzt vorbei. Ich hab's nicht mehr geschafft. It's not a set in stone rule to use the hip hop target on a hip hop song. Sometimes the EDM target sounds better. You have to experiment with it. My most used uh, targets are EDM, hip hop and Pop. Between those three I can find one that suits my uh, needs. You can see the target curve that Ozone is trying uh, to match. Also you can focus on specific ranges by just clicking the solo button. This is a really important uh, function for mastering. You can really hear exactly what is going on, for example, in the low end or in the top end. On top, we have EQ and stabilizer, and you can adjust the strength of those with the sliders. You can also bypass the two modules. Let's uh, start playing with the EQ and stabilizer. Those two are connected with the tone of your master. I think that the EDM target adds a bit more hype to the song that I actually like. Let's uh, stick with that. The, the slider affects the tone, making the EQ moves a bit more obvious or more subtle. Then we have the width match. On the assistant view we only have a single slider and with this we can manipulate how wide your master sounds. Ich war immer für dich da, wann ich es konnte. 
Trotz all dem Config, baby, ich war immer down with you. With Dynamic Match, we have the Impact and Maximizer. Impact focuses on adjusting the dynamics or better say the micro dynamics of your song based on the selected uh, target. That means multiband compression or multiband expansion depending on what uh, you need. Ich war immer für dich da, wann ich es konnte. Trotz all dem Config, baby, ich war immer down with you. Ich war down with you bei jedem Streitgeld, den wir so hatten. Ich hab keinen Plan, ob du's weißt, für alles tun, für dein Lachen. Doch es ist aus mit uns beiden, geil, es ist jetzt vorbei. Ich hab's nicht. The Maximizer helps you achieve the desired loudness. Up means louder, down means quieter. Ich hab's nicht mehr geschafft, fuck, es ist an der Zeit. Ich hab dir gegeben, was du wolltest, doch du warst immer toxic. Hier zu bleiben war impossible. Ich war immer für dich da, wann ich es konnte. Trotz all dem Config, baby, ich war immer down with you. Ich war down with you bei jedem Streitgeld, den wir so hatten. Ich hab keinen Plan, ob du's weißt, für alles tun für dein Lachen. Doch es ist aus mit uns beiden, geil, es ist jetzt vorbei. Ich hab's nicht mehr geschafft, fuck, es ist an der Zeit. Ich hab dir gegeben, was du wolltest, doch du warst immer toxic. Stop. Mastering is important. You know what else is important? subscribing to my channel please do that if you enjoyed this video thank you let's get back now we also have this optimized for with two options streaming and dj player and this basically changes the ceiling of the maximizer leaving more headroom for streaming so the streaming platforms have enough headroom to transcode your uh, song This is the assistant view and I really believe that you can achieve great sounding masters without leaving this page. This is great for artists that want to get a balanced uh, master without too much effort. This is also great for demos and writing sessions. This is fast and gets you great results. But if you need more control, then you can dive into what is the Ozone individual modules by clicking this detailed view. Here you can change everything from EQ settings to compression, stereo width. It's everything you have in the assistant view, but on steroids. On the detailed view, I want to focus on just three things that are new to Ozone 10. First, the stabilizer module. This is an adaptive mastering EQ and it makes everything sound a bit better. You have the same targets, you have two different operation modes with shape and cut, three different bands, a global amount, speed, sensitivity, and a button called Tame Transients. For me, this replaced Gulfos because of how easy it is to use and because you can use this in cut mode to reduce resonant frequencies. Let's select the hip hop, increase the, the amount to 100%. Now we are in the cut mode, so we are not adding anything, but we are cutting in a dynamic way with this uh, intelligent adaptive mastering EQ. So if you have a harsh uh, track, if you have a track that is uh, bass heavy, you can use this to gently remove uh, that. With the shape mode, you cut, but you also add something to the signal. And the curve, the EQ it's trying to achieve, changes with the target. A cool feature is the delta. Here you can listen to what you are cutting and what you are adding. It's a really great addition to Ozone uh, 10. Another one is impact and this is really cool because you can fine tune the dynamic of the song. This is really helpful, especially when you are dealing with not so great mixes. For example, you can make the kick hit harder or you can reduce the hi-hats. Let's make the kick hit a bit harder on this uh, section. 
you can see that impact is again multiband i want to boost the punch of the kick in this particular region you can sync the envelope this is a really cool uh, trick to add some in sync movement with uh, the music Again, we have Delta, so we can listen to the signal that we're adding or removing. I want to tickle just a bit the kick. Let's uh, reduce uh, the hi-hat. We can increase the global amount. The effect is subtle, but it can really help to deal with uh, some problematic uh, mixes. I use the impact with great success when mixing MP3 with vocals on the instrumental when I have some dynamic problems. The last thing that I want to talk about is the soft clip. When mastering, I usually tend to use clipping to tame some of the peaks. This helps with gaining a couple of dB of headroom. Now we have a soft clip inside the Ozone 10 maximizer. The soft clip has three different modes, light, moderate and heavy. And just to make it really easy to understand, take a look at the analyzer. I'm gonna push the threshold so I can start having some uh, gain reduction. Now if I push more the soft clip, you can see that we will not have those gain reduction uh, movement on the limiter. You can see that without the soft clip, the limiter digs much deeper into the material. We are splitting the gain reduction between the maximizer and the soft clip. This really helps with achieving a louder master. What do you think about Ozone 10? Are you one of those engineers that like to keep it simple and you use the mastering assistant or you like to get down and dirty into adjusting the individual modules. I hope that you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe, follow me on Instagram. Thanks for the support and see you guys really, really soon. Cheers.